what's going on guys and welcome back to some more black sales reactions man we are here guys the final episode of black sales season 4 episode 10 and i am pumped to see how they wrap things up with this series am i going to agree with it am i going to disagree with it you find out next time on black sales yeah <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm just messing around i'm excited to see this um because you know i i dove head deep into this series from start to finish um this series has been suggested on the channel multiple times by different people from when from even when i was watching game of thrones people were suggesting black sales that i should watch black sales a lot of people is kind of zoning in on terabyte reacts um on the type of shows that i like to watch and you know stuff that i get excited for you know and i might not be the most exciting reactor of all times but i start i try to stay as authentic as possible in the things that i do and yes some of the times you might watch a whole episode and i don't really say anything but i have much to say in the review um you know and that's just how it is with me like i'm not the type of person that watches a show and you know every little thing somebody says i'm jumping out of my seat oh my god oh my god i can't believe he said that oh uh, yes he was just talking about strawberries why is that so exciting <laughs> you know but the <laughs> I'm just making fun of some of these reactors out here that really thinks that I'm supposed to believe that it's th that that's how you act in real life. No, you're just putting on a show because you know it gets you views. And I've seen some people, especially in the anime community, Jesus Christ, it, it's bad. <laughs> the anime the anime reactors out here. Like it's really bad, man. Like the way out they act for every little thing that is said and it's just like good i'm calling out certain people I'm not gonna call any names but you guys know what i'm talking about you know i've talked about it plenty of times on the channel um and i've noticed some that some people is bringing that to tv shows as well um but it is what it is you know i just stop watching people who just gets over excited over every little thing that a, that a character says like come on it's not that exciting if, if you if a, if a moment surprises you that's fine it happens to me you know plenty of times too but for episodes that's just dialogue going on pay attention to the dialogue and stop talking <laughs> you know what i'm saying and get into it but anyways guys let's jump into the episode let's go watch the episode and i will see you guys for the review all right so <laughs> we are done with black sales season 4 episode 10 the finale let's review this was you know game of thrones could have learned a lot from this series and how to wrap up a series so that Pretty much anyone who's been watching the show throughout is satisfied. Like, I'm good with this ending. You know what I'm saying? I'm great with it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like they did an excellent job of wrapping it up in this one episode of tying up loose ends. Um, because we know they didn't have it. They, they're not going to do another season to do a war or anything like that. As I said in the beginning... I think it was in the intro I said that they don't have enough time. I think it was like two episodes ago in a re review. I don't remember exactly. And I was like, two episodes is not enough for them to go into a war. So I want to see what they're going to do to satisfy the consumer of watching the show. And they did an excellent job. They did an ex excellent job of wrapping it up, of telling us whatever happened and blah, 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 blah. When, when, um, when John was talking, was talking about Flint, I was like, no, he didn't kill him. So what happened? Like, I want to know what happened to Flint. And, and I'm, I'm happy that they didn't leave it up in the air. 
you know what I'm saying? So that was great that, to like, if you don't watch this series throughout, you would not understand. And as I said before, love, I think it was like two episodes ago I was talking and I was saying that love is like the, the theme of the show. It's what people are doing for love and you know, and how far it can push them and stuff like that against, you know, war and bigger picture and stuff like that. Like that was pushed to the forefront for a while, but then you just have this underlying piece of hugeness. Well, I don't even know what I'm saying, <laughs> but love, you know what I'm saying? And you can see that they were wrapping it up in that way of just love being that theme that is going to carry throughout the end of the series. And they did an excellent job of showing that. Would I have gone the direction that John went? Probably not. I would not have done that. I feel, I felt like, you know, it worked out for the good. And that, that, that is what I don't think it would have happened this way in real life, but it is what we have to come to accept based on what was going on and stuff like that. This is better for everybody. You know, um, Max in charge, dude is the governor. Fine. I'm, I'm good with that. So they, they made sure they showed everybody, everybody who was significant, their role in the ending of wrapping up this show. They didn't leave anything to chance. They made sure all the characters that mattered from season one until now got their time in the sun to, um, to push through. As I said, I'm not going to spend too much time on this review because I will be going over a lot of this stuff in my complete series review of this series, man. But as I said, there's nothing that you can do at this point that they could have done. Well, they could have still botched the ending and not let us know something, but I don't think there was anything significant that it was going to happen that I would refuse to give this series a 10 out of 10. They did what a job four seasons of absolute perfection. I can't even find a fault. And the one fault that I would find not necessarily anything that's going to that affected the show in any way because it was barely noticeable. So we'll talk about it. I'll talk about everything. You guys know the three points of what I talk about for, for series. For me, that is what I judge. I judge the, 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 the sound design for the show or score, if you want to call it that. And I, I review the, um, the videography, special effects, um, choreography, all of that stuff, um, in that category. And the last one is rewatchability. Would I watch this series, um, again, you know, just on my own or to see somebody else react to the show? And you will have to watch that review to find out if that's the case. I have to take some time, a little bit of time to actually think about it, think about everything, try to remember as much as possible from the series and, and do the review then. Uh, but I'll see you guys next time. As, as always, man, the, the, the theme of this show was very well done. The story was very well done. They dropped some serious bars in this show and stuff that is especially the last conversation that John had with Flint, like that conversation, I'm going to have to go back and watch it because there was a lot said in just that little snippet that they were talking to each other before, you know, whatever they, you know, before they brought him to the, some plantation or whatever to go meet up back with Th with Thomas, which is, I was very surprised by that. I was not expecting it because I think he knew when he asked him the question, I remember in earlier ex episodes this season, he asked him, he's like, suppose I was supposed to tell you, suppose you found out that Thomas was still alive, what would you do? And he, and Flint kind of deflected. I, I think at that point, John knew. He knew already that Thomas was alive. He just wanted to see how Flint was going to play everything out and then he just dropped the bomb on him. You know what I'm saying? So, um... But man, it was brilliant. It was brilliantly done. As I said, I don't want to say too much here because it's going to take away from what I'm going to do with the review. So yeah, appreciate you guys for sticking around for all four seasons, man. You guys supported this series 
greatly of course we didn't we weren't doing like thousands of views or anything but i did enjoy you know the two three hundred of us that watched this series the hundred and something you know um consistent views that i got on these videos and that's just what i've come to expect from my channel um now for 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 most shows is that's the range for us i don't know why the algorithm doesn't push my videos more because I just I guess people are just not watching these shows uh, or whatever the situation is I'm good at least I know where my fan base is you know what I'm saying like I, I know what to expect for any series that I do on the channel that's what I'm expecting because that's my average views on on um, videos that I put out there are series on the channel that do really well but for the most part that's the average you know what I mean um, and those are stuff that I've done in the past but in any case guys thank you guys so much i appreciate y'all um as always man thanks for all the people that signed up for early access to watch these videos um early a uh, week before you know everybody i think it was the only thing that was consistent and that's because i was just enjoying the show so much um but we're going to take a break of course look out for the review video of the series and we're going to take a break and see what we can come back with and see um what series we're moving on to next appreciate you guys stopping by as always like comment subscribe if you're new i'm out peace